Hello everyone. My name is Tara Moore and I will be giving a brief presentation on the determinants of health in vulnerable populations. The eight determinants of health are homelessness, poverty, mental rule, and migrant health, infectious disease, addiction, and violence. The CDC defines determinants of health as factors that contribute to a person's current state of health. These factors may be biological, socioeconomic, psychosocial, behavioral, or social in nature. The interrelationship of the aforementioned determinants, simply put, poor health outcomes are often made worse by the interaction between individuals and their social and physical environment. Therefore, where you live can be a significant indicator on how well you live, as well as how long you live. For example, if you're a migrant worker working in the fields and is often exposed to pesticides, that person's lifespan will not be as long as it could be if they were not exposed to those pesticides as often. Let me give another example of the determinants of health in regards to homelessness, infectious disease, and poverty. According to the National Health Care for Homeless Council, um, living on the streets or in shelters bring the risk of communicable diseases such as STDs or TB, as well as violence, both in physical, sexual, and mental nature because of the crowded living conditions and lack of privacy or security. These are just a couple examples of how determinants are interrelated. The picture on the slide lists even more determinants of how health, determinants of how health to show that there are many more factors that can affect health. In all, I feel that the quote from the Mental Health America sums the topic very well, and that determinants of health are the primary determinants regarding whether individuals stay healthy or become ill. Therefore, it is our role as nurses to educate, educate, educate with every patient contact to help bridge the gap between vulnerability and the known determinants of health. 